Taylor Swift and boyfriend Travis Kelsey attend Zoe Kravitz's party in New York City. On Saturday, November 9, Taylor Swift and boyfriend Travis Kelsey attended Zoe Kravitz's party in New York City. For the evening out, Swift wore a colorful Vivian Westwood outfit, a Sunday striped cotton corset dress with off the shoulder sleeves, and a blue striped skirt. The couple reportedly enjoyed dinner at Shea Margot in New York City's Meatpacking District. Taylor Swift paired her outfit with burgundy Aquazura Twist 95 velvet slippers and a black Vivian Westwood granny frame clutch. The era's tour star accessorized with a gold pendant necklace, small gold hoop earrings and a matching gold bracelet. She wore her hair up in a high ponytail with loose curls framing her face and wore classic red lipstick with cat eye liner and a touch of red eyeshadow. Kravitz wore a large black coat over an ivory lace trim dress, black tights and black heels, carrying a small brown handbag and wearing several silver rings. She wore her hair up and natural makeup with pink lips. Swift was seen in October hanging out with Carmichael and boyfriend Travis Kelsey at the MLB American League Championship Series at Yankee Stadium. He also joined Swift to watch the Kansas City Chiefs play the Buffalo Bills earlier this year. In an interview on Jimmy Kimmel Live. In March, Carmichael spoke about their friendship. Taylor Swift is my best friend. Like, I'm not her best friend, but she's my best friend, he joked. Can you think of a better friend than Taylor Swift? I called my old best friend and I said, you go out. Taylor go in. You never invited me to jet off to your game, speaking to GQ in November 2022, Kravitz shared that she and Swift grew closer during the lockdown in 2020, she's my friend, Kravitz explained. She's a huge part of life in London just having a friend that I can go to and cook me home-cooked meals and dinners on my birthday. In an episode of New Heights, Travis and his brother, former NFL All-Pro center Jason Kelsey, talk about Travis' experience going to night two of Dira's tour in Indianapolis. I wanted to see Tay one more time before this thing got closed up, Travis said. I'll tell you what man, the American crowds they did not disappoint. I heard that it was a lot more rowdy this time around knowing that she was coming back to stop through America one last time before the show was over with, Travis proceeded to gush about how incredible the show was. I'll tell you what man, that thing was rocking. Absolutely rocking, Travis said. If you don't believe me, Pat McAfee had one of the greatest show reviews that I've ever seen.